Hi there, we're Tim and Melissa West, locals here, right here in Victoria, BC. We have an Airbnb, and this is what we recommend to our guests. Today we're here in Chinatown, a great neighborhood to stay, to eat, and shop at all these cute little shops. If you're in Chinatown, Been Around the World is known for their coffee. Jam is one of the most popular breakfast spots in all of Victoria and a great place in Chinatown, but be sure to get here way before you're hungry because the lineups are insane. We just had breakfast there. What were your thoughts? This is a restaurant, breakfast restaurant, that has such hype in Victoria. So I'm glad to try it today. I had the hash. My hash was good. It was really good. It had uh, Montreal smoked meat in it and peppers and mushrooms and melted cheese on top. It was good. It was a little heavy for my taste. I had the Benny. It was really tasty. Small portion, but it was really yummy. I guess overall the question is, is it worth the hype? I think if you can beat the lineup, yeah, by all means. This is the Chinese public school. It's now a museum that you can come to and see how children went to school in the late 19th and early 20th century. One of the most interesting things at the beginning of Chinatown, if you're facing in on the right-hand side in the Gate of Harmonious Interest at the base, is a time capsule that was buried in 1981. What do you think is buried in there? It's gonna be dug up in 2081. We are in the heart of Chinatown at possibly Melissa's favorite Mexican restaurant in all of Victoria, Maze. Why do you like it? They have these fresh, organic, stone ground tortillas and they are so soft and so comforting and they have them on their tacos and quesadillas and then they have these fresh tamales. The ingredients are so fresh and the salsa is just nice and spicy. And the people are so sweet. So sweet. You gotta see the operation. The operation's amazing because they're actually making them and they come off the machine and they go, the whole thing is really mm -hmm. cool. Anyway, in the heart of Chinatown, if you're looking for really good quality Mexican mm -hmm. food with really fresh ingredients, maize, mm -hmm. 100%. Fantan Alley is Canada's narrowest alley with lots of cute little shops. Let's go take a look. Something not to be missed in Chinatown is Dragon Alley. Let me show you. It's got this really cool lighting effect throughout. It's a lot quieter than Fantan Alley and as an extra bonus, there's a coffee shop called Union Pacific Coffee at the end of the alley, which is amazing. We're at LaRue Patisserie right here in Fisgard. And why we're here is actually because the owner over at Mays, the chef over at Mays recommended that I try the Alma Croissant. But they also had cake of the day, which looks amazing. So I'm gonna try that all right now. What kind of cake is it? That is raspberry and it is delicious. Hint of lemon. The raspberry is lovely. The icing is quite decidedly lovely. Uh, it's cold. The icing is actually really quite cold, but the actual cake itself is really light and fluffy. It's, it's yummy. It's not super filling, but really tasty. And let's see if the chef at Maze is right. It feels quite heavy. Lots of almond in there, I guess. <laughs> oh my gosh. Are you serious? Really almondy and flaky pastry. Wow. <laughs> Highly recommend. We're having tea as well. They serve Silk Road teas here, which the store is just up the street. Silk Road Tea is a beautiful Canadian tea store, loose leaf tea in the heart of Chinatown. And they're fantastic teas. I'm having an herbal tea, Philosopher's Brew, which is lovely ice. It's got a lot of lemongrass in it. And we've also got a nice Earl Grey tea here as well. So good. I think this might actually be the best almond croissant I've ever had. Like, it's delightful. Wow. Really, really good. This is an incredible art store here in Victoria, BC. Whether you're an artist just starting out or you have a budding artist in your family, definitely come in here. The staff is incredible and the supplies are amazing. Chinatown has lots of cute little shops that you can go into and browse around. There are lots of cute stuff to pick up for your home, take home as mementos as your time in Victoria. There are lots of local artists too. 
Dumpling Drop is a great place to have a snack or even have dinner. They have homemade, handmade dumplings that are to die for. Here's another local artist that does pottery. I love these mugs. Lots of things to pick up for the kids in your life. Another local artist. So many great things to pick up. This is a whole star with local artists in Chinatown. A great place to walk around and just enjoy. Bao is a fantastic place to eat dinner. They have these steamed buns that are so soft and delicious. Highly recommend this place for dinner. Leave a comment below the video saying, I subscribed and I'll reply back personally.